After more than two hours of negotiating, Milwaukee police officers made their move. We identified that there might be possible mental health issues, uh, and when the opportunity arose, uh, he was taken into custody again with no incident. Officers wouldn't tell us what that opportunity was, but police said the 27-year-old man had a gun. Police used an armored vehicle and blocked off several streets while they worked to talk the man down. Crisis negotiators come, uh, they start rapport with people, they talk to people, uh, as well as the detectives talking to family members to see what type of uh, crisis an individual goes through. My little cousin, man, he's straight, man. You know, he just bi bipolar, schizophrenic. You know, if you don't take his medicine, this is the type of situation what we're going to have down here. Fred Johnson said his cousin is a peaceful guy and doesn't know what drove him to that roof. The man don't harm nobody. What he do around here is what he do around here. He don't get no trouble, no police contact, no nothing. Neighbors and family say they were relieved officers didn't fire any shots to take the man into custody. And police say the 27-year-old suspect uh, is in police custody tonight in a hospital for an assessment, Adrian. And Ben, I know you mentioned that gun. Do you know where police found the gun? Well, we asked police that same question. Where was the gun when police made their move to take him into custody? Officers told us tonight that this is part of an ongoing investigation and wouldn't comment any further. Back to you.